Hi ladies, this is Jamie. Uh, I just wanted to do a flip through on this pink Valentine's journal. Um, it measures eight and a half by five and a half. It has a hitch post with an elastic for the closure. Um, it's got uh, corrugated cardboard that has some uh, gesso and um, some of this stuff here rubbed on it. It just adds a little kind of a rose gold touch to it. And this is what the spine looks like. It's one signature. And I forget how many pages it has in it. Um, the cover is mm, like semi hard, semi soft. It's, it's, uh, I can't remember if it's two layers or three layers of like cardstock I think it's two yeah it's two layers of cardstock and on the spine it has two layers of um, it has fabric lining the spine on the inside and fabric on the outside so it's really uh, really strong so let's go inside and we have a corrugated pocket here, corrugated cardboard pocket <laughs> with a little cluster with a flower and a heart and a little uh, envelope with, I've seen these little notebooks from uh, Pam at the Paper Outpost. You can... Um, tear little pieces of it and use it in your journal or do whatever you want with it. It's a fun little piece. There's some lace on the page. I got this from a little, it was a little golden book calendar. And... Here is a little collaged pocket with an index card and a guest check. I just put some washi tape along the perforated edge there so it would um, so it wouldn't rip. And then we have the page here that I just cut some hearts out and put this little. Oh, that one doesn't open up. It's a little heart tag with a little paper button. And all the music paper that's in here has something to do with love, romance, uh, lovey-dovey stuff. Lovey-dovey stuff. Call me thine own. I don't think it's screaming Valentine's, but... It's got a hint of Valentine's. This is a little, uh, just a little cluster with a flower journaling card. Up in that corner tuck there. It's coffee stained paper. This opens up and has a little index card on the inside. And it also flips out. It's got a little collage there so you can journal on all that space and journal there or do whatever. Whatever your heart desires. This is a belly band with a little journal card that's been collaged. It's quite thick too. It's a it was like an alphabetized uh, divider for index cards. And then there's this little 
thing that opens up. I just stuck that over the index card divider. My heart at thy sweet voice. This is just a little envelope that's been punched and some fabric sewn on. And it just folds out like that. And I just set it over the page like that. This is a little pocket that's paper clipped into the page. Um, it's just some, uh, I was going to call it fabric. It's, uh, oh my goodness, I can't find my words. Pattern paper. Oh my gosh. Isn't that awful? Pattern paper <laughs> that I, uh, cut to look like little tickets. So there's a pocket there and there's a pocket down here and a pocket inside there too. And on this side, this is a journaling card. You could almost use it as a little writing board too. It's got some body to it. Some more lace. And these are some love birds. Uh, peach faced lovebird, red faced lovebird, Madagascar lovebird. So I thought they fit in there perfectly. This flips out and says attract on it. And it's got a pocket there and a pocket there and a little dangly here. This is one of those little fold a letter. I'm not sure what they're called, but you write your letter in there, you fold it up and mail it away. But we use it in our junk journals. <laughs> you do whatever you want with it after it's yours, whoever buys it. Okay, I love the and this is a little, um, this pocket here is from Pam at the Paper Outpost. It's, she calls it a burrito style pocket. And it's just got a cluster on it. Let me see if I can get that back in there. Oh, and that just says Be Mine on it. It's a bookmark. And this could be used as a writing board also. Um, it's just got some collaging, some handmade paper, and some uh, those washi stickers that I love so much. And this is also some handmade paper that I, well, it's recycled handmade paper. <laughs> because it's made from other paper that I shred up in my blender and use a mold and deco and, and make a new sheet of paper with it. It comes out so soft, and um, it just feels so good in the hand. And you can write on it very nicely, too. So that I thought that was cool. Here's another little pocket with a round tag in it that you can journal on the back. This is a little heart that flips out. <clears throat> you can journal on the back there. I made these. I was going to dangle something from there, and I forgot to. Um, so I'll do that after um, After I'm done the flip through. I'll put some bow pins on there <clears throat> and dangle some charms from, from down there. And this is a little pocket. I showed making these on one of my videos. Um, and you also have a pocket up here and a pocket down here. Whoops. I cut my nails, so now I can't reach anything. Ugh. So there's a pocket there. And that's like this one. It just folds up. 
and then you can open this up and there's also another pocket here you can journal some more lovebirds well it's the other side of that page And this is a little envelope, fold-out, flippy thing. Goes like that. And it's got little pockets here. This is another one of those little heart booklets with a um, double-sided altered paper clip. That just slips over the page like that. This is a little banner tuck that's got a postcard. I put this side of the postcard, I, I like to, it looked better there. But the other side is pretty, but it just has a birthday greeting on it. But I thought it went well in the book because of all the flowers in the little wheelbarrow. I got that from uh, a door prize from Elizabeth Brewer. She's famous. <laughs> She's a nice, nice lady. Let me tell you. And laugh. You never know what's going to come out of her mouth. <laughs> she makes me laugh. That's for sure. And that's, that's awesome. And then these. I absolutely love these. I've seen these from Pam at the Paper Outpost. Um, this has got some lace and some rickrack and some little pink hearts and it opens out and says thinking of you opens out that way and it opens this way um, it's got a little die cut there opens up here and it says love at the top so that's really that was a lot of fun Oops. and this page here we have a little, I made these, I was inspired by uh, Eva at Bohemian Crafting. Um, you have a little pocket here with a journaling card. It's blank on the other side. And you open it up and you have a little notebook here, some more journaling areas. And on the back, there's a little tag, tucky thing that tucks right in there. And then I just lean that over the page like that. This is another little flip pocket. It says Cherish with a little journal card. And a little tag and some more collaging there. This opens up. Secret journal inside of there. And on this page we have some tickets and an index card in behind. And then on the back cover, we have another corrugated uh, cardboard pocket. And I don't know if I mentioned on the inside, there's some lace and some rickrack that lines the uh, spine there too. And then we have just a few little things. Another one of those little booklets. And a little tag. And there you go. There's a flip through of Pink Valentine. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Bye.